Imagine for a moment a colossal asteroid hurtling through space. Now ponder this. What would happen if this celestial body collided with our Earth? The vast expanse of space is an enigma that has captivated humanity across generations. Among the countless mysteries it holds, one that often stirs our curiosity is the potential for asteroids to collide with Earth. These celestial bodies, though usually out of sight and out of mind, carry with them a significant potential for destruction, depending largely on their size, speed, and composition. Picture an asteroid of considerable magnitude barreling towards our planet at incredible speeds. Its impact wouldn't just create a hole in the ground, it would generate an explosion of energy. The larger and faster the asteroid, the more devastating the explosion. The composition of the asteroid also plays a crucial role. An asteroid composed of dense metal would cause more damage than one made up of loosely packed rubble. Now, consider the location of the impact. An asteroid striking a remote area would have a very different impact compared to one hitting a densely populated city. A collision with the ocean could trigger tsunamis, causing widespread devastation along coastlines. On the other hand, an impact on land could lead to fires and other localized destruction. Moreover, the dust and debris propelled into the atmosphere could affect global climate, potentially leading to a phenomenon known as an impact winter. Yet, it's not just about the immediate aftermath. These impacts could have far-reaching effects, disrupting ecosystems and potentially causing mass extinctions. The asteroid believed to have caused the extinction of the dinosaurs is a stark reminder of this potential for mass destruction. So, the aftermath of an asteroid collision isn't as simple as one might think. It's a complex interplay of numerous factors, each contributing to the overall outcome. The vastness of space may be awe-inspiring, but it's also a reminder of our vulnerability in the grand scheme of things. Now that we understand the variables at play, let's delve deeper into what happens during an actual asteroid impact. When we think of an asteroid collision, we often envision a straightforward sequence of events. A giant rock hurtling from space, slamming into Earth, and leaving a massive crater in its wake. But the reality is far more complex and intriguing. Firstly, the size of the asteroid plays an enormous role in determining the scale of the disaster. A small asteroid, say the size of a house, would likely burn up in our atmosphere before it could reach the ground. But an asteroid the size of a city? That's a different story. It could potentially cause a crater hundreds of kilometers wide, trigger climate-altering events, and cause mass extinctions, much like the one that wiped out the dinosaurs 66 million years ago. The speed of the asteroid also matters. The faster it is, the more energy it releases upon impact. This energy can vaporize the asteroid and a large amount of the Earth's crust, sending debris into the atmosphere. This debris can block sunlight, leading to a nuclear winter effect that could last for years. The asteroid's composition is another important factor. An iron asteroid would cause a different kind of damage than a stony one. Iron asteroids, being denser, would penetrate deeper into the Earth's crust, causing more localized damage. Stony asteroids, on the other hand, would explode before reaching the ground, causing widespread destruction over a larger area. Lastly, the location of impact, whether it's land or water, can drastically change the outcome. A land impact would result in a massive explosion, ejecting a huge amount of debris into the atmosphere. An ocean impact, meanwhile, could trigger tsunamis and cause widespread flooding. As we can see, an asteroid's impact isn't just a simple bang and done, it's a cataclysmic event with global repercussions. With the potential for such catastrophic events, what measures are we taking to protect our planet? Enter NASA's DART mission. The Double Asteroid Redirect Test, or DART for short, is NASA's first line of defense against potentially hazardous asteroids. This mission, which is as ambitious as it is crucial, serves to test technologies that could deflect a threatening asteroid off its collision course with Earth. It's our first proactive step in the cosmic game of billiards, where the stakes are nothing less than our planet's survival. The star of the DART mission is the method of kinetic impact. Think of it as a celestial game of pool, but instead of a cue ball, we have a spacecraft, and instead of a pool ball, we have an asteroid. 
The spacecraft, traveling at a speed of nearly 15,000 miles per hour, would collide with the asteroid. This impact, while not powerful enough to shatter the asteroid, would change its velocity just enough, by a fraction of a percent, to nudge it off a potentially catastrophic course. It's an exercise in precision and timing, a testament to human ingenuity. Now, you might wonder, why all this effort for a slight change in velocity? Well, when it comes to space, small changes make a big difference. Altering an asteroid's speed by even a tiny fraction can equate to a difference of thousands of miles over time. Given sufficient warning, this could be enough to make an asteroid miss Earth entirely. The DART mission is not just a single endeavor. It represents a paradigm shift in our approach to cosmic threats, from passive observation to active defense. It's a crucial first step in a long journey of securing our planet's future in the vast and unpredictable cosmos. In the face of potential asteroid threats, the DART mission stands as humanity's pioneering effort in celestial defense, a testament to our will to protect our home planet.